Hey YouTube, it's TJ. Um, it's May 8th, 2012, and it's been 13, no, 15 days post-op for, for top surgery with Dr. Uh, Medali. Um, I'm just going to do a quick update, nothing long, um, just about how healing is going right now. Um, I think I would, I find it helpful when I'm, because right now I've been trying to search for how people, how guys are usually doing around this time, just to kind of gauge if things are okay with me. This kind of helps ease my anxiety, I guess. Um, so I'm just going to do a quick update on that because I, I figure it could help other guys too. Um, my nipples are starting to, I know I said in my last one that um, I was concerned about my left nipple, but it seems to be fine. Apparently what was happening was normal and it's peeling now. They're both peeling. Um, and they're both looking pretty good. Um, I've been keeping it, uh, keeping, uh, I'm done with the compression vest. I just finished that, um, yesterday. Um, and so I've been keeping them, um, I'm done with the, um, the antibiotic ointment. Um, so that's, that's cool. I think I am going to put a little bit on my incision. Um, I finally took, the stereo strips didn't come off on their own. Uh, so I contacted Dr. Medali's office and apparently, um, you need, uh, I needed to take them off myself. So I just took them off myself and I just spent probably about 20 minutes taking the skin glue off because it's just, um, didn't want to come off very easily, but I'm glad it looks a lot better than what I thought now that I got the glue off. Um, the incisions look pretty good. I do have a spot right here that's kind of, I know it was a little bit rough taking off the, off the uh, skin glue, but it's bleeding a little bit, nothing major though. So I'm going to put some ointment, antibiotic ointment on here, but I've been keeping everything, um, from drying out, which is, you know, it's a big thing that you gotta do. And I've been putting um, non-stick pads over everything and then putting one ace bandage loosely around just to keep it from, keep them from falling off or rubbing up against my clothes because I don't, I don't want the ointment and all that shit to get on my clothes and I, I don't want to use tape. So that's, that's been working okay. It's not on tight or anything, so it's not a big deal. Um, but what I can do is I can kind of... Everything is still really, really, really swollen and numb. It's very swollen and numb right there. Very swollen right in here and numb. Really feels almost hard. Here it's... It's not hard, but swollen. I don't know if there's... Some fluid still left in there. Um, same thing over here. S swollen, numb, and it's numb. And but there's some feeling coming back right here. I think I haven't even touched my nipples. I'm just too freaked out about that. I don't want to touch them right now, except when I'm putting ointment on them. I don't really notice any feeling. So I'm assuming they're well. Obviously, they're numb. I'm not feeling anything. Um, but everything is going pretty good. I'm still really sore. Um, I'm back to work. I've been back to work this week. Uh, of course, I can't take um, the good the good stuff um, during the day. Um, so I'm really sore towards the end of the day. Um, it almost feels like I either did a million like bench presses or um, I, my chest was pounded on for like an entire night because that's what it kind of feels like. It's just that. It's just really sore. But what I can do real quick is just um, kind of give you a look at what um, what's going on. Um, that nipple's almost completely peeled. Like the areola is completely peeled. Uh, there's still some left on the nipple itself. This one's still peeling quite a bit. Um, but I think it looks pretty good. The incisions are looking good. Uh, for the most part, especially up in here, the incisions are looking relatively good. Underneath here, there's a lot of bunching, and but um, yeah, I, I think it's going to turn out really well. 
Um, so, you know, there's, that's about it. Um, I just want to do a quick documentation on that. Um, and I really want to get back into working out now that I see what my body looks like the way, you know, without a chest. I'm like, ooh, I need to do some work. Um, yeah. <laughs> so, uh, I'll try to keep giving another update maybe next week or in a couple of weeks. See ya. Bye.